Welcome all. It gives me a great pleasure to share with you the good news regarding the a new drug, newly authorized drug, single infusional uh, IV infusion drug, uh, Sotrovimab. Sotrovimab is a drug produced by GSK and uh, Ver Biotechnology, and it receives an emergency use authorization from the US FDA for treatment of mild to moderate COVID-19 in high-risk adults and pediatrics. Uh, Sotrovimab has not been approved, but has been authorized for emergency use by FDA and EUA to treat mild to moderate COVID-19 in adults and pediatric 12 years of age and weight 40 and above, 40 kg and above. With positive results of COVID and who are at high risk for progression to severe COVID-19, including hospitalization or death. The evidence behind that it came from the phase three. This is interim analysis for phase three comet eyes trial. Comet eyes is COVID-19 monoclonal antibody efficacy trial intent to care early trial, which demonstrated an 85% reduction in hospitalization for more than 24 hours or death in high risk adults receiving uh, sutrovimab compared to placebo which is the primary endpoint of the trial. For in the inclusion criteria, they uh, allowed or uh, recruited 18 years old with high risk uh, for progression of COVID or any patient 55 year old, old uh, and they consider the age per se about 55 or more is a risk factor. And the participants must have positive COVID results and oxygen saturation 94% or more on room air and have COVID symptoms and be less than or equal to five days from onset of symptoms. The, this technology, they adopted also a very interesting uh, technology that increase circulating half-life, which is the extent technology uh, that uh, this increased circulating half-life by increasing binding f affinity to receptor, uh, the receptor FCRN, which present inside lysosomes in endothelial cells lining the blood vessels and functions to rescue antibodies from the degradation that makes most proteins short-lived in circulation. Half-life extension can be exploited to potentially improve therapeutic antibody performance in several ways, just such as increasing dosing interval or decreasing drug quantities at the same dosing interval compared to apparent antibody. And this drug now uh, also approved in the United, United Arab Emirates and will be uh, almost approved in many countries. Thank you.